Hey friends, it's Squigs back again with another episode of Squiggy's Rom Hack Romp. Today we have Super Mario 8P 8P 8P, which is what it was titled in the hack name, but it looks like it's um, colon P colon P colon P, and it's made by colon P colon P colon P. So, <laughs> this one honestly caught my, uh, caught my eye by name alone. Oh my god, you cheeky motherfucker. Look at you. <laughs> Alright, so this should be good, I think. It's, well... I'm really confused at why I start at the castle and I can go n north. Let's go to Vanilla Secret, the castle first. This is strange already. It's telling me to leave. Okay, maybe this is just like a little place where I can get a feather so I can beat the whole game really easily. Okay. Wow. Okay, I did not expect that at all. So, I, I like it already. I have a feeling it's gonna be a silly one. <laughs> Let's go the other way around. I'll probably get a... Oh, I'm, I'm such a dummy. Whatever. Let's see if I can get them back when I come back out. Oh, no, they're gone. Oh, uh, here we go. So this is gonna be one of those fast auto-scrollers. Oh, no it's not. That was... Okay. So what happened there is my, my Mario sprite's not allowed to move left and right. It's kind of like a stuck-in-one-spot auto-scroller. I was not expecting that. So we're gonna get the, uh, god damn it, I need to really drop my, uh, drop my mushroom first would help. We get the feather, because it'll make it much easier. Yeah, okay, I've played one of these before. Not too bad. Now that I know I can't move left and right, it does help a lot. Okay, we'll just try to hover as much as possible. That's our strategy here. That was bad, okay. No more hovering as much as possible, although if we got a full bounce off that bullet bill, we probably would have been fine. Alright, this time I'm dropping my mushroom first order of business so we can see what's in that other, uh, that other block there. I'm thinking it's gonna be a fireball. I'm hoping. Yeah, okay, so now we know we can get whatever we want here, too, as we move forward. And let's try our weird auto-scrolling level. Okay. If I could've grabbed that shell, that would've been nice. But it's not the end of the world. Okay, there, we got the bounce. That's good. Oh my. <laughs> Holy crap. That was close. Alright, that was kind of a bummer, because really could use that. Oh, shit. Oh, this just got stupid. That part's going to be really hard, but maybe a little bit easier if we can keep our keep. I'm kind of curious what's in that level up, up, uh, that I can just move to all of a sudden. Right from the beginning of the game, the 8P, 8P, 8P level. <laughs> just like, colon B, colon B, colon B. I don't know what to really call that face. I guess you can call it the tongue outsy face or something like that. Like, I don't really know, so I went with colon P. <laughs> God damn it, I thought I could hit him. I was almost positive I could. Oh, I missed my jump. We'll get there, folks. Don't worry, we'll get there. Wow, okay. This is not getting any easier. I have played these kind of levels before, but I don't have much practice with them, I'll tell you that much. Well, yep. Once your mojo gets messed up, you're done for, folks. You're done for. Ah, oh, I grabbed the P-switch. I'm holding the run button for absolutely no reason at all. Like, it's gonna help me go faster or something. Okay. Here we go, folks. Can we float? Jesus. We made it to a midpoint. Haha, <laughs> okay. I was just getting nervous this was gonna be like a super extreme type of level where, uh, it's just too hard to reasonably do, but the fact that there's a midpoint at there, it gives me good hope. Oh my god. That's not good, though. That's not good, folks. So we got a little bit of a, a speed increase in the second level. Uh, it should be fine, I would think. Once we get used to it. These auto-scrollers, yeah, you just gotta see them. See them a little, move forward, do a little better each time, kind of something like that. I want to know what, what's the deal with that, but whatever. Jesus, okay. 
Every time the speed catches me by surprise because I'm used to our jaunty little stroll in the other level. And what's going on with the overworld back there? Like, why is, why is Yoshi's Island being conquered by forts and shit? Like, they're everywhere. His house is still there, though. He still lives there, despite the new territory owners. God damn it, I can't make that first jump. It's pretty embarrassing, folks, but I mean, it's just not Super Mario World, not the one I'm used to, so we gotta, gotta warm up to it a little bit. Okay, let's see, we'll grab our feather. Doesn't even matter if we have one in our inventory box now, because we are down to the last life. And we'll see if we can pull this off, at least get one jump in. Wow! Incredible. Is this just, you better have a fucking feather, dude? Or is this gonna not kill me? Um. Hmm. Did I miss something? Or is that really just how it goes? I guess we'll go back there and check. I'll meet you when I get the checkpoint. No, that's actually easy now. It's not even bad. It's just those last one at the end that kind of trip me up, those single blocks. I never like the single block jumps. You know me. It's just not fun. God damn it. Well, it should take us five lives to go see what's there again, hopefully, so... We can just get through this real quick, and then take a wild leap into nothing and probably... Like, I don't know what solution I'm expecting to happen that could be good. So we can just skip over that, jump here, and then jump here. That's pretty much all. Is this not completed? Is it just not completed? I'm taking a look in Lunar Magic, folks. I'm gonna just take a quick peek -see. Let's open this ROM. Okay, folks, so do you see this level here? This is where it goes. Nowhere. Not to mention that these stompers never come out of anywhere. So that's terrible. Uh, if you have an unfinished level, the player should not be able to get into it. That's pretty fucking obvious. So, minus points for that. And I guess we'll just go up to 8p, 8p, 8p and see if he's been laughing us the whole fucking time. It's another castle. <laughs> What the hell is this? Okay, so it's a boss? In which I kill the mi- oh, Okay. What is this hack? <laughs> Give me that feather, please. Do not fall super slowly. Like, it's little pea faces that shoot bullets. I guess it's probably a fucking demo for the, uh... For the scripted mini-boss, maybe? I don't know. I don't know, folks. I guess we'll just we'll just figure it out. Oh, maybe we won't. <laughs> okay, let's give this another go. We should have really gotten some power ups first. Oh man, I thought I could get both of them right at the beginning. Okay, I'm gonna get those power ups and then make this a little easier. I. I actually don't know if I can start select out of this. I probably can, considering I didn't beat it. I don't know why I think I would be able to. But I can. I don't understand this hack at all. Did I just beat it? What? Hold on. <laughs> what the fuck is this? You can't go right, or it pushes you up? Is that true? No, you just can't go right at all. This is fucking confusing. I don't know what the artist was going for here. Uh, Alright, let's give this another shot. Okay, we got it. We got him once at least. Now he's super mad. We got the other guy. He dropped... I, I have no... Am I supposed to jump on him again? I guess so. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, well, whatever. We'll just do it. It's not like we don't have infinite lives. Where do I get that mushroom at? Right there. Okay. 
Oh, I see. Oh, cool. So that will turn into something I can shoot at the boss, hopefully. Interesting. I think we should do much better this time with a few power-ups on our side. Actually, why not one more? Okay. Now, if we can get these guys right off the bat. No, I wanted both of them right off the bat. I really could have used that. This is tough. I keep going in with nothing, but it really is tough. Wow, see, if I just, if I find, like, the safe zone, I'll be all set. Oops, don't want to turn off all the graphics, that's extra hard mode. Okay. Thank God for the fast forward button, it helps everyone out. Okay, so these guys go in. There, that's what I wanted to do from the start, every time. Then, okay, they do come to these corners eventually. Please hit him. I, I'm not sure if I have to hit him with every single one of these hits is why. Oh my god. Oh, uh, that was dumb of me. I wanted the mushroom more than I wanted to stay alive. Alright, so if I can get that double hit from the beginning again, we'll be in good shape. That's what's up right there. And then he's eventually going to come down here. Right there. I killed it. I don't know how. Okay, that's not bad. I can get this down, I think, now that we got the pattern, just like every other boss. Okay, having another one of those is very nice. Get him! Oh man, that was a pretty good one. Dropped my controller, but uh... <laughs> that was pretty good all around. Oh, this one I'm just gonna die. Because I want the power-ups to have a, at least a fighting chance. Alright, this ain't so bad now, is it? Okay, so we stay to the left. We wait for our opportunity right from the beginning. Bang and bang. And we get in the corner. Wait for them to come at. Bang. Okay, not good. Okay, we lost one of the ammunition. That's bad. It's a whole round wasted. Okay, there we are. Oh, you asshole. Okay, that's good. We're looking good. And there's three? Not enough. God damn it. I really wish it was three, but I suppose if you're gonna make a boss, you might as well make him hard. Okay, he shoots down in that corner all the time. Okay, four. And five seems like a good number, right? Don't do it like 20. God damn it, why? No, any more than five, I'm not down with. Every time in that corner. Ah, oh, fuck. If this is gonna be like a 20 hit boss, it's just annoying after that point. Maybe six. Maybe six I'd let slide. Two threes, it seems okay. I mean, you should have done five, but the six, maybe. If it's nine, 12, could be anything. 10? Can you imagine? Okay, this is bad. This is a bad run, folks. Can't be wasting shots like that, either. Although, with just one... God damn it. Is he gonna shoot more fucking mushrooms at me eventually? Yeah, we could fire mushrooms with just one in the room. Or at least get up to two where it's safe again. Wow, that came close to hitting me. Damn it. Or maybe I'll just fucking die. I feel like those first few hits are very important. Let me get that. Okay, that was an excellent first round. There we go, we got the first two. We lost our feather though, that's bad. Really does help things out a lot. Hopefully. Yep, okay. The more I watch this guy, the small guy, closely, 
the better I'm doing. God damn it. That's really bad. Maybe I shouldn't watch him so closely. Oh, that's a strategy right there. Yeah, I get hit by the bullet bill in the corner. No, hitting the hitting them twice. One guy twice instead of maybe I could hit. Yeah, that's it. We'll hit both of them from the start, and then we'll hit the second guy twice before he even goes up. Let's see if we can get in that habit. The less time we spend uh, jumping around in bullet hell, the better. <laughs> because I can only last so long. Okay, here goes the new strategy. One, two, three. Pretty good. Wow, I have no idea what happened there. One, two... No, we didn't get the... Th the oh, I thought he was... I don't know why I thought he was coming at a different angle. Okay, we missed that. At least get him with the hit. Nope. Give me a fucking mushroom, dude. Hook it up. Thank you. Ah, uh, I can't time it. Yeah, can't time it very well. God damn, this is frustratingly hard. Don't kill me. One, two, three. And I killed the block, making it useless anyways. Damn it. Lost the feather to get the mushroom. Not the best trade, but what are you gonna do? It's done. What's done is done. Give me another mushroom. Thank you. Oh my god. What the fuck just happened there? Oh my god, why couldn't that one be a mushroom? God damn, this is hard. Well, folks, I just found that you can go beyond... Uh, colon P, colon P, colon P. So this is Donut Plains with a little a little mark in it. It might just be a, a remake of some sorts, but we might have a level here. Nope, this is not a level. So actually, let me reverse out of this. Is this just like a free roam map or something? That's fucking weird now, isn't it, folks? Like, and why is it in such strange... What are those little characters? It's like it's mostly in English. I don't know. I don't think that's how the Japanese one looks, is it? It might be. I can't. Oh, that's weird. Let's let's try this fucking boss again. Let's see what we can do. Well, that's a bad start. A little disheartened right from the beginning. Here we go. One, two, and three. Oh my God, that was beautiful. That needs to happen like every time. Get rid of one. Oh, I really could have used that. Okay, so this isn't bad right now. God damn it. Oh, fucking... This is really annoying. Just knowing that I have... What? Get that out of here. Like, knowing that I'm gonna have to do, like, six hits of this is just too much. All right. Whoops. Fucked up which one was which. God damn it! Give me the feather, please. Uh, I don't need... Uh, whatever. Kill me. Oh my god, I can't do anything right. Like, I don't even really want to do this. It's not even really a hack. It's just a, like a tech demo of a boss that someone came up with. I mean... Hmm. I could just jump ship, we could bail. Hold on, let's just fucking beat it. Let's cheat it to beat it. Let's see what happens. Yeah, because I really don't feel like grinding out this boss when there's not even a game to play along with it. We're just gonna fucking do shit like that until we see how this boss ends. 
Oh, we want that. Thank you. Yeah, that's what I wanted to do every time. God damn it. Yeah, I'm so fucking awesome when I have the the reset. <laughs> it's just stupid. I want that. Give me that. Okay. Alright, yeah, see, who has time to replay all this over and over until you nail it perfectly? This would be a good, like, final boss of a hack, though. Like, it's not, it's just not worth it to me if I haven't played, like, actual levels as well. Alright, let's see. Okay, now it's in fucking saw blade mode. Like, what am I even supposed to do with this? Just, like... In what way... Am I able to damage this person now? Is this just a waiting game? I mean, I can sit in the corner and wait, I guess. Um... Yeah, I really don't even know how to beat this part. I don't think I can do anything with those things he's shooting down. I'll try jumping on one. I don't think I even can. I know I can't jump into it, so... Unless this is just like a really long waiting game, this is annoying. Everything's coming to the corner at once. <sighs> God damn it, my corner is no longer safe. Like, is this just waiting? Over and over? Is there supposed to be something I can do here? What? I'm supposed to downward stomp on those? That's not very likely. God damn it, that's annoying. Now he's red. Uh-oh. Jesus Christ. Uh, like, like, look at this. Do you see how many things are on screen right now? Like, <laughs> what the fuck am I supposed to do with this? There's no way in hell I'm beating this in a reasonable way. This guy's gonna spit out more than- he's gonna spit out stars for this to be reasonable. Oh my god. Just die! Oh my god, it disappeared right before it hit him. That's lovely. Wait, I'm getting that one. There we go. Come on. There we go. Jeez. Well, that was very nice. All in all, it was a very well-made boss, but that is fucking hard. Like, I don't know how a reasonable person is supposed to be able to complete that. It's kind of like, um... But that might not be what it's intended for. Could be the end of a Kaisoak. How the hell do I know? So that's probably about it for this one, I think. Yeah, we got this weird, <laughs> weird fucking overworld that I can free roam around a very small part of. I didn't even unlock. Well, I can. It doesn't matter. I can just go to it. What is this? Why is this like this? Oh, I can't go to the um. This is what? Yeah, see, it's very confusing, the overworld they chose for this. I don't know why they would mess with this at all if all they're trying to do is make a mini-boss. But anyways, as I said, mini-boss was fun. Way too hard for my taste, but at least it was inventive and cool to play. 
So I hope you enjoyed this episode of uh, Squeeze Romp Hack Romp, and I hope to catch you all next time, friends. Take it easy.